everybody welcome back to my channel it's Lisa here again and finally finally I'm doing a nursing video after so many promises that I'll be doing a nursing video I'm finally doing it should be like oh yeah I'm finally doing one and as you can tell by the title I'm gonna be talking about night shift because I am a nurse who works night shifts so I'm gonna give you a little insight about how night shift is the pros the cons the good the bad all of it so I want to compare it to day shift since I did was I was able to work like two weeks of day shift when I first started so I'm going to compare it to day sh the experience that I have for day shift compared to what I'm doing for night shift now so just a little insight I started working night shift um, in August and I had got two weeks of day shift experience before I started night shift something about my unit wanted me to do that with all their night shift nurses just to get a feel of how both um, shifts are so when I started working night shift I was kind of nervous because I heard it was like a lack of resources you didn't have much you're basically on your own and I'm like I'm a brand new nurse I don't know everything I just know the basics so far I want to gain the experience and whatnot so I was scared and um, if you don't know I did a vlog for my um, first night shift ever and it's on my channel if you want to go check it out and see how I freaked out you can do that I'll leave the link of that below but um, I mean after the first night it was pretty chill pretty cool so I'll compare it to what I had for days so during nights it is technically basically you're on your own that's number one you're on your own you don't have your director you don't have your supervisor sometimes you don't even have a charge but quote unquote you're on your own but you're really not because you have all the other nurses there with you and all the experienced nurses so if you have a question you go and ask those questions all the time don't ever be afraid I mean yeah you have to use your critical thinking at night because if a patient something's wrong with a patient you don't know what's going on you just have to really think and like put the pieces together and you know don't be afraid to ask all the other nurses there like you know if you're working with another nurse who has like 10 years 20 years of experience don't be afraid to go ask them questions because I do it all the time I mean even the minimum questions I ask because you never know we're dealing with people's lives here and you never know like I mean you have to ask these questions so I definitely go and ask those questions so technically yes you're on your own but you're not really on your own because sometimes you do have your charge and you have additional resources you can call you know rapid response if you have a question you know ask them and they're really nice especially in my unit and floor or in my hospital in general rapid is always so willing to teach you and have you know you know tell you what's wrong what's right and it's just awesome um, compared to days days are crazy like I work two weeks of days and it's just like crazy you have to be running back and forth you have doctors you have your director you have your supervisor you have case management you have everything everybody everywhere wanting your attention plus the patients on top of that so yes during days you do have the good resources and at nights you don't really but at nights we kind of work as a team that's number two we always work as a team no matter what when we have admissions coming in especially on my floor it's a observation floor quote unquote so they only stay for like two to three midnights so they the admissions are back to back you have discharges admissions discharges admissions all the time on the floor and on my floor on a, like one section you have to fill it up between um, by midnight so that usually happens the majority of the time so you might have like two three admissions like coming in um, one after the other so definitely when you have a charge nurse they are like gifts sent from God I'm telling you because they help you out so much and um, yeah they help you out so much they print all your charts to get your fish for your patients especially when you're running around like crazy I mean they are like amazing so you do have those people who are working with you as a team especially other nurses who are there with you at night I love my people on my floor my nurses on my floor my techs especially oh my gosh I love them they're so amazing 
they help us out you know we work as a team if one person is behind on something hey do you need something I can help you you know I'm, I'm all caught up for right now do you need something do you want me to go see what your patient want the call it is on you know we don't wait for somebody to ask us to do something we all jump up and go and I feel like we work more as a team during the night because we have such limited resources at night than we do during the day so I mean it's yeah it's good and bad at the same time so I mean during the day you do have doctors there and if you have any you know questions for the doctors any concerns they're there with you all the time at night you don't that's number three at night you don't have the doctors there you know at to ask some questions or whatnot you have to call so I hate doing it but you have to call if you want to get an order or you want to get if you want to ask a question about something you want to tell them about a lab that came back you know bonkers or weird or something like that you have to call or we have this thing this messaging system where we can message beyond call and ask for orders which in a way is good and bad because sometimes it takes them a while to respond and sometimes they respond really quickly and if you're not a person who who's like who's a, who's afraid of like talking to people it's great because I'm like when I first started I was like super scared super nervous I was like really intimidated talking to doctors and I like this messaging system was like the greatest thing because I didn't technically have to speak unless it came to a point where something came critical and I had to like talk um, but if you need something right away the best bet is to call the on-call and get what you want but like during the day they have the doctors there they're rounding they're looking at their patients and I mean that's good for days bad for nights in a way but I like having the messaging system so <laughs> it works out both ways um, I mean night shift in general it's just to me it's great I don't know why people like shy away from it I really like it you do have some kind of downtime which is number four you do have some kind of downtime in between it might be crazy when you're going in on your shift the first time around when you're going in everything might be all over up in the air everywhere and you're just like what the heck is going on and you get report you go like oh my god I have to do this 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 and this and then you probably won't sit down till about midnight which does happen sometimes and you just have to pull all those things together but the thing is you do have some kind of downtime to catch your breath to take a breather to look at the orders to look at things that you might have missed to actually you know understand what's going on with your patients look at all the documents look at all the results you know really understand that and you know during the day they don't really have that because they have to run around and get all these things done to listen to the doctors do the roundings you know put the orders in and I understand totally understand how day shift goes crazy <laughs> especially on my floor they go crazy and I mean like they're awesome I love my day shift nurses as much as I love my night shift nurses but they get I mean like it's just crazy during days and at night at least we have some kind of downtime maybe if you're lucky you get it around maybe midnight to like one o'clock after you pass your midnight meds if you have midnight meds you can get about like one two three o'clock in the morning and then it starts picking back up again so then before that you could do all your charting that you missed and you know get everything pulled together and you know if you have a new emission you got to get that done and you know it's just yeah it's just that <laughs> so you do have a little bit of a downtime at nights and I mean it's great I love night shift I mean for me I prefer nights over days a hundred percent more I mean yes you do miss most of your day when you're coming home to sleep the next day and you're off you do miss most of your days but to me it's better I mean I love my night shift people they're amazing they're awesome especially my techs and all my nurses I mean the techs on nights the techs in general are just amazing they are just the main thing they're like the glue for everybody they just help you out so much if they need something I mean I always ask my text if you need something let me know I'm gonna help you if you need to turn a patient if you need to clean a patient if you need something if you're over your head just let me know and I'll help you all the time I always make sure I like, let my text know that and I mean we all work as a team that's the main thing is to work as a team during nights you don't like I said you don't have all the resources and at nights you need to work as a team you can't just be by yourself because you're not gonna make it just by yourself you're gonna need everybody and every hand and like I said if you have questions don't be afraid to ask them you always have to ask those questions if it's the stupidest little question just ask because you never know you're dealing with people's lives and as my shirt says it's a beautiful day to save lives 
you have to save lives. That's what we do. We're nurses. We want to save lives. We want to make a difference in the world. And so I feel personally Night Shift is amazing. I love it so far. It's been like four months for me now since I've been a nurse all together four months and it's been about three and a half months since I started working night shift and I have to say that I love it you don't have to be afraid to go during nights it's not don't be afraid you have everybody there you have um, abundant amount of people about abundant amount of knowledge there with you you'll be able to do it if you're gonna start night shift if you're a brand new nurse you're gonna start night shift and you're scared don't be you have all the people you have all the resources you need for that time if you need anything else, you have the people there. Just ask questions. Ask lots of questions. Don't be afraid. So don't be afraid. You can't, I mean, I was afraid at first to ask questions, but I mean, eventually you just spew them out. And even the older nurses who've been there for like 10, 20 years still ask questions. So I mean, don't be afraid. So that's my video <laughs> talking about Night Shift. I mean, honestly, it's just... The job is amazing so far. I love it. I love what I do. I love all the patients that I've had. It's been great getting to see all the new experiences, get to getting all my skills and experiences and knowledge and be able to use everything that I've learned into the job right now. And it's amazing. So yeah, I finally did my nursing video, guys. Finally. So now, since I did my nursing video, we're all done. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and I hope um, it gives you a little bit of an insight on how Night Shift is. I might have rambled on a little bit, I might have repeat things a couple of times, but if I did, that means it's kind of important, you know, kind of something I want you to stick with you guys if you're going to be doing Night Shifts or you're going to be thinking to go to Night Shifts. Definitely, you know, take some of the tips that I gave you here and you know use them towards your you know your knowledge your skills and everything like that and don't be afraid that's the biggest thing don't be afraid you guys are gonna be rocking at night shift or day shift or any shift that you work so you guys are gonna be amazing nurses I just know it so yeah you guys if you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and you know click that subscribe button for more amazing videos from me um, maybe the next video I might be doing Maybe another reaction, maybe a nursing video, maybe a challenge, who knows. If you guys want to know where I got my shirt from, because it's awesome, I got it from this site called Shein. It's a uh, clothing site and it's amazing and they have the shirt in like different colors, white, red, um, or burgundy, uh, black, and I think gray, And but I like the burgundy version so I got this and you definitely I can leave the link of that below too. So yeah guys. Until the next video, don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to like. I'll see you guys later. Bye.